NXT last night, Daniel Bryan, <laughs> the situation here. And as many of you already know, I, I'm sure somebody, maybe somebody was hiding under a rock here. I, I have no idea. But a couple days ago, it was, uh, I believe, Fightful that initially had reported that there were sources both inside and outside WWE that they had spoken with that indicated Daniel Bryan's WWE contract was either expiring or or was set to expire after his SmackDown match. That report was later confirmed by Dave Meltzer, and obviously Daniel Bryan choked out by Roman Reigns left laying, and that's the last scene we we had of him from SmackDown. And aside from a, a brief period of time when he was released in the company in 2010, Daniel Bryan has been signed to WWE since 2009, 12 years now. In 2015, he was forced to retire from pro wrestling due to concussion-related medical issues it was at that point he had his three-year contract frozen by the company a few years ago outside doctors were beginning to clear brian but it took until wwe doctors made that decision in march of 2018 uh, for him to actually return and i did see this uh, about uh, an hour or two ago a fightful reported that they had spoken with uh, several members of talent about Daniel Bryan and what they may think uh, is in the cards for him. And what some are saying is uh, they Daniel Bryan didn't make a big deal out of his contract expiring and it only heard it through the grapevine. So, you know, they were still, they were surprised when they heard it coming to an end, but uh, Sean Ross Sapp also went on to announce that were uh, mentioned that ring of honor, uh, is expected to make contact with them as well as two AEW talents that they had spoken with. Uh, fully expect Daniel Bryan to stay with WWE with one outright saying, uh, and this is a quote, uh, saying they've heard, uh, saying he served, with, <laughs> pardon me, uh, the quote is this, uh, AEW talent we spoke with say that, said they fully expect Bryan to remain with WWE with one outright saying that they've heard he is staying with WWE. Of course, we cannot confirm that. It is just speculation, unquote, there. So that is coming over from Fightful, Fightful Select, and Sean Ross Sapp. So I don't know if that's going to be a downer for anybody uh, if people think take that to be true about Daniel Bryan uh, staying with WWE. But if I'm WWE... I want to keep Daniel Bryan around. Mostly it's to keep him away from everybody else, and I know how selfish that is, but, I mean, come on. If you're looking at things through WWE's, you know, vision here, you know, it's going to be a little bit selfish. So there's a way for this to work for everybody, which is, you know, Daniel Bryan actually acts like a real independent contractor and does some stuff for WWE when they need him to and then is able to go out and do a whole bunch of other things. But, of course... You know, that, that may not be as, as fun for trying to speculate where he may go, uh, you know, full time. I know a lot of people would love to see him in New Japan full time. A lot of people would love to see him in AEW full time. I wouldn't think we're going to see him anywhere full time if he does leave WWE. Why? He's been locked down to one place for a long time. And as Dave has talked about and as Daniel Bryan has talked about, he's got a lot of other goals. He wanted to go wrestle in Arena Mexico for CMLL. Uh, obviously, AEW is now uh, a presence on the scene. You have New Japan and that New Japan Dojo, and you have things opening up. Now, obviously, in Japan, things are, are closing back up because of COVID, but in this country, things are going to be opening up all over the place. If you still have money left and you're a wrestling promoter and you could afford to do so, wouldn't you want to take a shot at Daniel Bryan from one of the bigger shows if you're a, a bigger independent company? Obviously, you would. But I want to get you guys' thoughts on this as well. Too. If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.